everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a two-part video in store for you. The first part will be an eye makeup tutorial on the look that I'm wearing today. And I'm going to be using the Delium Tool Smoky Eye Brush Set. This is a five-piece brush set, cruelty-free, vegan synthetic brushes. So I'm going to be using these for today's look. And the second part of the video will be a review on this brush set. So let's get started with the tutorial. So how I created this eye look, let's talk about the brushes themselves. So when you order the brush set, you get this little cylinder right here with the five brushes. This is the Smoky Eyes kit once again. And these brushes are cruelty free, they're vegan, they're made of sustainable bamboo. So they're very eco-friendly brushes, which is amazing. So these are the five brushes that you get. You get an all over shader brush that so you can apply eyeshadow all over the mobile eyelid area. You also get a crease brush and it's kind of a smaller one. So if you have small eyes, this would work out really well for you. Then you also get an angled contour brush. This is a lot fluffier. So you can use this to apply eyeshadow all over the lid. You can use it to blend things out like I did in the tutorial. You also get a pencil brush, a really tiny pencil brush as well. So you can smudge eyeliner, smudge a little bit of eyeshadow. So once again, if you have smaller eyes, I think this would be really great for you. And finally, we have the angled brush. So you can use this to just fill in your eyes or do eyeliner like I did in the tutorial. It's a really, really tiny brush. I would even say you could use this for your lips as well as to spot conceal because it is so tiny and thin. You can be super precise with this brush. Another thing that I find really cool about these brushes are the handles. They're made out of bamboo, so they're very sustainable, very eco-friendly. And the ferrules themselves are made out of aluminum, so they're not going to rust. And they're going to keep, keep their shape really well. So I think they're really well-made brushes. 
Now let's talk about the things that I don't like. And I have to say, this was my first time trying Delium tools. I actually saw this on Octoly, which is a free marketplace for content creators. And I was super excited because I've heard so many great things about Delium tools, especially from other YouTubers. So when I saw this, I wanted to review them. I wanted to see what the hype was all about. And I have to say, this wasn't my favorite brush set. Although they're very affordable, this is $27. You get five brushes. They're all vegan, cruelty-free, like I said, synthetic fibers, which they do have a lot going for them, but I have to say the synthetic fibers are a little bit on the stiffer side. So I had a little bit of a tough time blending out. I just don't like the synthetic fibers on these brushes. They're soft, but a little bit on the stiff side. So they do retain their shape really well, but I just, I would have liked something a little bit fluffier, especially the crease brush. The crease brush is very stiff. As you can see, it just springs up when I move it around, which is good because it will keep its shape, but it doesn't really allow to blend things out and just diffuse it very nicely. So that's one of the things I don't like. The smudge brush is also on the stiffer side, so I have a tough time just smudging things out and make, making sure it just diffuses very nicely. It just deposits way too much on your eye, so I don't really like that. I think my favorite brush out of the set is definitely the eyeliner brush because it's so tiny and precise. You can definitely get a really nice wing. You can use it for so many different ways. Like I mentioned, you can use it to fill in your eyebrows and create really tiny like feathered strokes like you, you'll be able to mimic brow hairs like it's that precise you can also use it to fill in your lips you can use it to spot conceal this is just a very versatile brush I really love this brush and the other brush that I really like is the angled contour brush which this just makes it so easy to create a one shadow eye look so you can apply eyeshadow on your mobile eye area and just blend it out really quickly so this one I really like these two I just don't like, and then this one, the all over shader brush, is not my favorite one. It's a little bit... I would have preferred something a little bit thinner. It's okay, but it's just not my favorite one. So my honest opinion about the Delium Tool Smoky Eye brush set, I really think $27 is a little bit too much, especially considering that you can find eco-friendly, vegan, and cruelty-free brushes at the drugstore. It's just very easy and a lot more affordable as well. So I do think they're a little bit a little bit too expensive for what they are. I also really don't like the synthetic fibers in this case. I find them too stiff, which is a good thing and a bad thing. So that's what I think about them. I'm not completely crazy. Yes, you can achieve a smoky eye or just a regular everyday eye look with these, but I'm not completely crazy about them. I will link these down below in case you're interested or just want to check out the other brushes from Delium Tools. I definitely do want to check out maybe their face brushes or something else, but my first impression just based on the eye brushes themselves, I don't like the fibers too much. <laughs> so that's what I think about the Delium Tools Smoky Eye Brush Set. It's okay. I really don't think it's worth $27. You do get free shipping if you spend over $20, so you would get free shipping if you do purchase this, but in my opinion, they're a little bit overpriced for the quality, so that's what I think. Let me know in the comments below if you have tried any other Delium tool brushes, and if you have, which ones do you recommend, because I would love to explore a little bit more in that brand, so let me know in the comments below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're brand new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe by clicking right over here and I will see you guys very soon in my next one. Bye! Pretty heavy box I have to say so let's open it up. We have the little card as always right here without any product information and then the box looks like this so it does look very